have the skin. So you think about this whole layer of membrane that so many toxins can just get stuck in there if we're not sweating enough, if we're not pushing it through. So the apple cider vinegar helps draw it out. So does the spirit of water. And so does the nutritional yeast. So what do I do? I do, whoops, I put um, parsley. So this is the parsley scrub, and I often will use the parsley scrub to scrub off the spirulina. So the parsley scrub is really easy. This is just curly parsley. Um, and this is a great use for like, if, if you forgot to juice your parsley or use it, and it's like getting like almost too old to eat, make a scrub with it. And so I put, you know, like two tablespoons of apple cider vinegar in there. With the parsley, the recipes are on the uh, back recipes page on blithrod.com, but you just saw two ingredients, easy breezy. In that room, you guys can join the crowd at the top of the player so you can chat with us. And thanks everybody that's already here. Okay. those greens in. We're gonna be making a raw tomato bisque and a walnut apricot appetizer or, or entree, really. So quick and easy raw foods. Remember, this is the show about quick and easy raw foods raw beauty treatments, and eco lifestyle tips to help you. Erica, why does this gorgeous plant you got hanging from our ceiling here? Kind of an impulse buy. Yeah, I love an impulse buy. I saw it at the nursery this morning. It's a topsy turkey. It's for people who have no space, but some place to hang something and some sun. And okay. it should be outdoors. Or, I mean, unless you have like ridiculously sunny hot kitchen. Ah! Um, so this benefits a few ways. Uh, but for me, number one is the pest. So Strawberries, it's hard to so get. This is so strawberry plant. Yeah, all strawberries. It's and it amazing. grows and will start to hang and you'll have berries just all the way around. And you don't have to worry about snails or slugs getting to it. Yeah. It's off the ground. It's gorgeous. And I mean, organic strawberries are like $6 a pint. Oh, they're really what a great expensive. way to have, grow your own. How much will they yield? And that's my first question. How much will this yield? My second question, does strawberries keep producing fruit? Yeah, or it's is a it like perennial one? plant. And okay. so, you know, how much, that depends on how well you take care of it, how much sun it's getting. Um, What's but ideal? Indefinitely. I mean, for really? years. Whoa, really? That'll just keep yeah. producing. How and much And then you that get cost? babies, too, because, well, that you can just gift a container for, I think it's like 20 bucks. But I bought the whole thing planted at the nursery, oh, at an expensive nursery, and it was $50. So okay. I know you can do better than that. 